The torch. I nagged my mum and dad for a torch. Oh, go on. I'd love a torch. One of those ones with the black rub around them. Oh, go on, please. It was no good. I wasn't getting anywhere. Then came my birthday. On the table was a big box. In the box, a torch. My dad took it out the box. You see that torch, he says. It's waterproof. That is a waterproof torch. Waterproof. Wow. So that night, I got into the bath and went underwater swimming with it. Breathe in, <gasps> under the water, switch on, search for shipwrecks and treasure. Up, breathe, <gasps> under again, exploring the ocean floor. Then the torch went out. I shook it and banged it, but it wouldn't go. I couldn't get it to go again, my birthday torch. So I got out, dried myself off, put on my pyjamas and went into the kitchen. The, uh, the torch, it, uh, it won't work, uh, it's broken. And my dad says, what do you mean it's broken? It couldn't have just broken. How did it break? I don't know. It just went off. I don't believe it. You ask him a simple question and you never get a simple answer. You must have been doing something with it. No, it just went off. Just try telling the truth, will you? How did it break? I was underwater swimming with it. Are you mad? When I said the torch is waterproof, I meant it keeps the rain off. I didn't mean you could go deep sea diving with it. Ruined, completely ruined. For weeks and weeks, he nags a stupid that he wants one of these waterproof torches. And the first thing he does is wreck it. How long did it last? Connie, how long did it last? Two minutes, three minutes? These things cost money, you know, money. I felt so rotten. My birthday torch. At the weekend, he says, we're going into Harrow to take the torch back. We walk into the shop. My dad goes up to the man at the counter and he says, you see this torch? Hmm? I bought it from you a couple of weeks ago. It's broken. So the man picks it up. Well, it couldn't have just broken, says the man. How did it break? And my dad says, I don't know. It just went off. Surely you must have been doing something with it, says the man. No, 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 says my dad. It just went off. Oh, come on, says the man. These torches don't just break down. So I said, well, actually, uh, I, I was in the kitchen and I got a hard kick on the ankle from my dad. I was in the, yeah, yeah, the kitchen and uh, it went off. So the man said that he would take it out the back to show Len. He came back a few minutes later and said that Len couldn't get it to work either, so he would send it back to the makers. You'll have to have a new one, he says. I should think so too, says my dad. Thank you. Outside the shop, my dad says to me, what's the matter with you? Are you crazy? You were going to tell him all about your underwater swimming fandango, weren't you? Blabbermouth. 